Hello YouTube, this is Alexander again. Today I have this uh, little device on my bench and um, if you don't know this little device, this is a touch sensor for to detect any fish on the line and uh, you can do anything you want uh, um, while this little thing is uh, detecting the fish for you. So this little device comes from a um, fellow worker of mine and uh, he asked me about the supply of this device. Unfortunately this kind of device use a lot of voltage for working and uh, despite the fact that the housing of the battery is very little, uh, the battery inside which is normally inside because this is not the case is a 12 volt battery and um, uh, it's a very bad battery because uh, they have a very bad behavior in the time and uh, not very easy to find and uh, to replace you need to to have this kind of battery at hand when you need it and this is not very easy to do that for to make it more easy i um, i i I, uh, I make a suggestion to uh, to my fellow worker is uh, to to try to uh, to test this device if it's able to work under this 12 volts and uh, if it's this is the case may, um, maybe it's possible to um, to make another supply uh, or maybe um, uh, after his own request maybe an external supply for to uh, make uh, this uh, little uh, device working. So uh, what I'm doing here is uh, to connect this um, battery housing to the power supply and uh, try little by little to uh, inject little voltage uh, until the, the this little device works for to see if uh, it can work with a voltage less than 12 volts for to try to make a solution for to uh, to make uh, the supply of this uh, device uh, more easy so uh, what i guess there is a little uh, trouble in this um, device uh, because i guess i absolutely guess it's uh, not able to work if i connect it directly so before to connect i'm i'm going to dismount it and uh, see how it's made inside before to, to uh, supply it for to take apart, I'm going to use this uh, beautiful screwdriver um, coming from Lidl, as you know. And let's go for to take apart this little device. As you can see, there is a little um, PCB inside, and uh, the module detection is not uh, more than a little uh, pulley as you can see here with a magnetic with a little magnet inside and uh, the pulley will turn when the, with uh, the wire uh, when uh, the wire leads this uh, pulley you will have a, a magnetic field uh, going through this uh, little uh, red switch and make some alternative uh, switching with which is uh, interpreting and interpreting by the this little uh, ic which is uh, um, trigger schmidt trigger something like that so for the moment uh, we don't have a voltage going through this uh, circuit what i'm going to do is to inject any voltage and uh, try to understand why this little thing doesn't work. As you can see, there is um, the power supply on this uh, little diodes. As if, if, if you can see this little diode here. And uh, this is not normal because uh, this is uh, um, protection diodes and uh, the threshold of this uh, little diode must not exceed 0 0.7 volts and uh, maybe this little diode is uh, dead, dead I'm just going to short circuit this uh, little diode for to see if there is any response of this unit
now there is um, enough place, enough room for to make this little uh, battery inside and uh, we just need to more secure this for to avoid some short circuit in the PCB and uh, try to make it uh, working. Now the test for to see if um, to close the device is not a problem now. Okay, it seems to be perfect, no problem at all. So now we need to connect the supply on the PCB and uh, try to. Um, um, I have to manage it for to. Uh, to find a solution for to, f to charge the battery with an external system or internal system for to have an idea about the the abilities of the battery I intend to use this device coming from the last uh, cigarette electronic and um, I want to keep this little uh, uh, PCB because when you are switching the little button here you have the idea with the LED about the the charge of the the the, the lithium ion battery and for to charge it I want to try to put this little device on this uh, on this gadget for to have an external uh, chip uh, mini USB type for to charge the the little battery by external way you can see here the charging module and uh, the wire coming uh, from this uh, charger module to this uh, level indicator and this wire or the wire which are intended to connect it, to be connected to the PCB for supplying the, the device This is the battery status.
here this is uh, the LED uh, for to show that this device is working and uh, it's supplied by this little resistor uh, which in fact I found is not uh, so much height and uh, the light is very strong for to uh, enhance the um, the abilities and the duties of the battery I, I will change it for to decrease a little bit the light for to, uh, to, to, to win some duties just changing this resistor by one uh, high, little bit higher Now as you can see the project is uh, finished, now it can work with only one cell battery uh, and 4 volt uh, instead, instead 12 volt uh, like from the start and uh, it's not uh, difficult to, um, to recharge this uh, device because uh, you can see this uh, battery charger is a very simple use for to charge it like this. If you need to uh, to charge it uh, in emergency, as you can see, you have a LED here for the charging. Uh, she's uh, orange because uh, it's uh, on a charge process. And uh, of course, if uh, you will, uh, if you wait a long time, this uh, light will turn to blue. And of course, for to uh, have an idea about the battery status. You can you can push uh, the button here. This device was the original device uh, from the electronic cigarettes. I uh, put uh, it on this uh, little stuff, and uh, so that's all. And uh, of course, uh, uh, this device now is uh, fully working, uh, rechargeable, and. Uh, and uh, for to use it, if you have uh, some emergency for to uh, to replace the battery, you have just to use your regular ch uh, battery charger like this one with a micro USB for to charge it. And so this is all for today. Uh, I'm, I think uh, this uh, little device is able to to do some uh, fish party. And uh, so tell you, see you soon.